So you seem pretty confident that, that inflation is temporary, but if you're pumping all of this money into the economy, couldn't that add to... No, the, the, look, here's the deal. Moody's today, when our Wall Street firm, not some liberal think tank, said, if we pass the other two things I'm trying to get done, we will, in fact, reduce inflation. Reduce inflation. Reduce inflation. Because we're going to be providing good opportunities and jobs for people who, in fact, are going to be reinvesting that money back in all the things we're talking about. Driving down prices, not raising prices. And so it, it is, I, 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 I sincerely mean this. Prices are up now, and they're up in, for example, you're in a position where you're trying to build a house, try to find two by fours and lumber. Yeah. Well, guess what? People stop working cutting lumber. They stopped doing it because they, their, their, their unemployment was so down. Now all of a sudden there's this need because people are coming back, and guess what? Instead of paying 10 cents, you're paying 20. I mean, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. It relates to what, in fact, is now needed because we're growing. I don't know anybody, including Larry Summers, who's a friend of mine, yeah. who's worried about inflation, is suggesting that there's any long-term march here if we do the things we're going to do. Well, let's start with this. Uh, prices have gone up. And families and individuals are dealing with the realities of, of the, that bread costs more, that gas costs more. And we have to understand what that means. That's about the cost of living going up. That's about having to stress and stretch limited resources. That's about a source of stress for families that is not only economic, but is on a daily level something that is a heavy weight to carry. So it is something that we take very seriously, very seriously. And we know from the history of this issue in the United States that when you see these prices go up, it has a direct impact on the quality of life for all people in our country. So it's a big issue and we take it seriously. And it is a priority therefore.